My name is Anthony Napolitan. We're out here at the new Woodward Park City. Uh, we're doing the grand opening ceremonies and it's pretty sick. Uh, this Woodward Park City is pretty epic. It has a lot of features built within the building. It's kind of a, a multi-level building. Uh, the very top floor has a massive pump track for BMX, skate, rollerboards. Um, and then you have your stock foam pit resi uh, with a massive roll-in into that and a uh, adjustable lip that's, I don't know, nine feet tall and it's kind of has like a real mellow transition, almost like a mega ramp lip. And then even underneath the roll-ins, there's cool little skate features. So there's like a four foot tall uh, coping coping mini ramp spine and a cool, cool vert wall that comes up like a Euro ledge. Uh, they even have a handrail that goes into an airbag for, for skating and BMX stuff. I think the concrete park uh, holds a lot of relevance for BMX uh, in this facility. The concrete park's pretty unique. It kind of has a little bit for everybody. Uh, there's a lot of street obstacles. Uh, some, of the, some of the bowls are actually pretty deep in them as well. Super smooth transitions and there's, there's a lot of lines kind of zigzagging around the, around the bowl. They've got uh, coping coping spine, a uh, bunch of cool hips and like vert wall features and kind of quick transition features. It's it's literally like we did a demo on it and you know it was anywhere from like transition riders, dirt riders, street riders, like everyone was enjoying it. Right now we have a lot of snow because it's winter out here. Um, but the all the ski and snowboard stuff is open. They have a, a Olympic spec super pipe out there. Uh, massive booter jump, bunch of uh, p skill park kind of stuff. And then in the summertime when all the snow's gone, uh, there's a paved pump track that's out there. And that paved pump track is kind of like a segue that goes to the BMX jumps, um, who like Will, Will Blunt and his crew kind of built those this year. And uh, on the other side of the mountain is full on like downhill resort style mountain bike trails. So that'll have full lift access. You'll go through the trails and then hit the pump track and you go back to the lift and it takes you back to the top and you can rip. There's a couple different lines and features and they all end with like some pretty big dirt jumps too. Yeah, this whole grand opening thing is pretty special to me because uh, I was on the build for almost five months. So I came out in July and then, uh, and then I finished up like right before Thanksgiving. Um, so it was, it's a, it's, it's a lot of hard work. We're kind of like a one-stop shop kind of, kind of crew. It's really awesome to have been here the whole time and, and build everything and watch the whole place progress. And then to be able to come back and, and ride everything and just kind of see the finished product. So the first thing we got, we finished on the build was the pump track. And, uh, that was kind of all we had to ride for a while. So we were just having sessions, you know, after a 10 hour day on the pump track and just having fun with that. It's so awesome being able to share this place with everyone. Uh, you know, they've got such a legendary list of people out here riding, uh, riding everything that we created. You know, got the Pastrana family, the Nyquist family, Matt Hoffman, Brandon Seminuk, Reed Boggs. Uh, dude, there's just so many names that are out here and it's really cool to, uh, you know, have this finished product and see everybody thoroughly enjoying it. Um, it's, it's just, it's, it's a whole different kind of feeling. It's, it's just so awesome. Basically what, what makes all the Woodward camps stand out is they're all one of a kind facilities. Uh, this facility is completely different from any other facility that we've built. Uh, there's a ton of unique snow features. Uh, they have downhill mountain bike course, which is completely different from any other Woodward. Uh, there's just so much stuff to ride. The BMX dirt jumps are amazing and everything inside the building is completely unique and, and different from anything else that we built. The Park City model is pretty awesome. It's, it's unlike the normal Woodward camp model where you, you know, go to camp for a week or two or whatever. Um, these models are really cool because you can just come any day of the week, pay a fee and ride at Woodward. Uh, they also offer season passes too, and they're, and they're relatively affordable from my understanding as well. Uh, so you could literally come here seven days a week if you wanted or skip a day or whatever. It's, it's almost ran like a local indoor skate park. And I think that model will work really well here in Park City. Uh, just because that's how everything runs around here. It's like if you go to a mountain resort, you know, you pay the fee or you get a season pass. So. Uh, I know there's just a ton of people in Park City that have been super stoked and waiting for it to open. So I think it's going to do really well. I think people should come to Woodward Park City because there's kind of just something for everybody here. If you're, you know, a four-year 
you're a four year old kid and you want to learn how to skate or ride BMX or snowboard or whatever, like there's something for everyone. You can start small and, and learn here or you could be a professional rider and have the best time of your life. It's there's kind of something for everyone here. Woodward's whole thing is they're they're just stoked on progression. They want to see people progress. So for us building everything, like we tried to make that we tried to make that kind of the key for everything we built. We just want to see people progress.